Coral reefs and bodies created. I'm sorry. Coral reefs and bodies, giant clam in Zudali, created by Jaron, Olivia, Sam, and Cecil. Giant clam is in Bali. A giant clam is up to three feet across and weighs more than 200 pounds. A xenthali is a microscopic algae that lives within the tissues of a variety of host animals. Symbiotic relationship. A giant clam and the xenthali relate by the giant clam eating nutrition from the xenthali and the xenthali lives in the giant clam. Symbiotic relationship. The relationship is common selling because the xenthali produces food and water for the giant clam. Interesting fact. Because xenthali make food most efficiently in fairly shallow, well lit waters, giant clams are most abundant there too. Coral reef symbiosis. Symbiosis. Clown anemone fish and sea anemone created by Kiaja, Valerie, and Camille. Coral reef symbiosis. Clown anemone fish. Sea anemone. Nestling among the venomous stinging tentacles of an anemone seems like a very bad survival strategy. Sea anemones are masters of disguise. Clownfish fight off intruders, such as a mini eating bird lunch. Symbolic relationship. Clown live, clown live in the sea anemone for protection. Clownfish fight off enemies of the sea anemone. They work together as a team to share food. Symbiotic relationship. This relationship is mutualism because they both benefit from the relationship. Interesting fact. Sea anemones are attached to the reef by a section. This tentacle swaying with the current. They are the animal, perhaps most effect, often mistake, mistake uh, as plants. Coral reefs some bias, manta ray and remora, created by Layla, Hayden, Jalen, and Richard. Manta ray and Remoria. Manta rays can reach 20 feet in width and weigh more than 2 tons. They are filtered feeders. They funnel tanning prey such as small fish, crustaceans, and comb jellies. Remora stick their head on the manta rays. Sim, sim, sim. Biotic relationships. The, the remora attaches his head to the to the manta ray to eat the its scraps. Each creature involves adapt, adaptation. Symbiotic relationship. This relationship is called. Commensalism. Because the remora is eating the scraps and the manta ray is not getting nothing out of it. And the remora isn't slowing the manta ray down, so the manta ray doesn't mind. Interesting facts. They don't harm each other and they act like friends. 
Coral Reef Symbios, Giant Triton and Hermit Crab, by Lucy, uh, Honesty, Cade, and Grayson. Giant Triton and Hermit Crab. When a giant triton dies, its tissue will be consumed by a group of dermals. Hermit crabs don't grow their own shells. Each, each time hermit crabs outgrow their shells. Hermit crabs have to avoid eating when they try to find a new shell because they would have to find a bigger shell. Symbiotic relationship. When giant triton dies, a hermit crab takes its shell. This relationship is consulism because only the hermit crab benefits. Interesting facts. A shell made by the living triton cannot be eaten. Unlike other crabs, hermit crabs, they are unable to Coral Reef Symbiosis, Sponge Crab and Sea Sponge by Catherine, Trey, Draken, and Callie. Sea Sponge and Sea Crab, their posterior legs are modified for grasping and the crabs use them to carry live halochondria sponges on their backs. Many sea sponges have evolved chemical weaponry. Symbiotic relationship. Sponge crabs carry this a I mean sponge crabs carry a sea sponge on their back for protection. By living on the sponge crab, sea sponge clothes not have a battle to battle for a room. The, relation, the relationship is mutualism because they both benefit. Sponge crabs don't have to battle for space because they're on the crab's back, so that's where they live. Coral reef symbiosis. Reef Lizard Fish Blue Street Clean Arrest by Landon Miles and a bone. Reef Lizard Fish and Blue Street Clean Arrest. Mucus has helped protect the reef lizard fish. Mucus is used to attract food. It attracts larger fish like the lizard fish to get its food. Symbiotic relationship. They use each other to get food for themselves by using one another. They clean each other. Interesting fact, Blue Streak Clean Arras cleans, it, cleans the reef li lizard fish. The reef lizard fish gives the clean arras food. 